Okay, everyone, this is just going to be a quick way to show you how to do a fun little, pretty detailed little Christmas tree. And afterwards, you can add presents or baubles or whatever you want for designs for lights or ornaments, depending on what you want to do with yours. But this is just a quick way to see how you could just make a quick, easy tree using your dot drag technique, swoosh, swipe, and using dotting tools. So I'm just taking different colors of green. And personally, I have an obsession with ombre from light to dark or dark to light. So you could even do it all in the same color if you wanted. I'm just going from the lightest that I had here and working my way down into the darker colors. So you just get a good amount on. And I'm starting with a smaller dotting tool for the top part. And you just dip it and dot like you're going to dot and then drag it out like you would a swipe. And if you don't get it all the way, just start back a little and drag it from there. This is a nice bright green that's one of the neons. And so I'm just using all the deco art paints here. And I can put a list for what colors I actually used on this stone. You know, there's some space in between if you want to do ornaments, or you could do it on a larger stone and leave larger space between, or at the top if you want to put a star or an angel or something at the top. But it's a good base for a design for Christmas, which I can't believe is coming up already so soon. It's amazing how fast it's going to be here. I'm just getting into the darker greens now and I just got a bigger size dotting tool to get the fatter swipes here. And so this is the Dazzling Metallics. Nope, I'm mistaken. This one is the Ocean Green from DecoArt. And I want them a little fatter at the bottom, just so it looks like the tree is nice and full and thick when you get to the bottom. And then we'll put a nice little tree stump there on the bottom. This one is the Dazzling Metallics. It's the crystal green. But this way too, you can see it's a little bit thicker rather than the thinner branches at the top. Okay, so now I'm just going to use a little bit of the rich espresso to make a little tree stump here. And also stopping a little higher gives you space to put presents or whatever else you want under your tree. Snow, different decorations. But it's just a fun, quick design to kind of start off with a holiday stone. I hope you found this helpful.